Let's head over to Abigail now. We got to talk about this forecast. Kind of a cool start. I was a little surprised, I guess, because you know it's been kind of warm. I walked outside. And I'm like, oh yeah, this is why I need a jacket today. Yes, yeah, so when I got in my car this morning, I actually had a jacket on and a sweater. I get oh. cold very easy, <laughs> so it was a bit of a wake up. So. We are going to have a cool start to the day. It is going to warm up a little bit, but we have highs in the upper 70s. So it's still going to be a little on the cooler side. It's a nice start to our fall. What we can expect for the day, we are going to stay dry. We do have some clouds starting to move in, but it's going to stay dry for the day. We don't see any systems off to the west. What we can expect is partly cloudy skies and a high in the upper 70s. Those winds are going to shift from the northwest to the south, so we will have a mild breeze going into the day. Looking at the temperatures regionally, we are in the lower 50s to start off the day. Right here in Terre Haute, that's still pretty true. Terre Haute 51, Greencastle at 52, Bloomington at 51, and Washington's a little cooler at 50 degrees. So once again, if those kids are getting on the bus, make sure they have a jacket because it is going to be a little on the cooler side. Those clouds have started to move out, but we do have another batch starting to move in, so it will be a little on the shade side today, so make sure they have a jacket. If they're anything like me, they will get cold. Looking at the winds, it's fairly calm around the region. We do have some mild gusts that will continue throughout the day, but we don't expect a high breeze today. It's going to be fairly mild through and through. Looking at the entire U.S., we don't really see anything out here. We do see some clouds starting to move in. This was in the past six hours or so, and if we look at Terre Haute, not much is going on. Once again, those clouds have started to clear up. What we did have over the valley has moved past. We do have another batch starting to move in, but we're only going to expect partly cloudy skies throughout the day. And just to give you a visual of that, Futurecast is going to show those clouds starting to move in in just a bit. Here it comes. It's going to start to move in, but it's going to be fairly brief. We're going to stay dry throughout the day, but we may see some precipitation starting on Wednesday. We could see up to a half inch. It's still kind of up in the air. We have models saying that we could see a half inch. Another one saying we're dry, so we'll have to wait and see on that. But for the most part, we are going to stay dry for today. Maybe some isolated showers for our Wednesday. We have a high of 79 today. It's going to be a little cooler than what we're used to, and it's going to be partly cloudy, and then that breeze is going to start up from the south. That will continue into our overnight. We drop down to 56 degrees. It's going to be cooler. Those clouds are going to move out of here, giving us a clear sky. So if you want to stargaze, it's a good night for it, but make sure you pack a blanket. And then looking at tomorrow, it's very similar to today. It's going to be mostly sunny, a high of 79 once again. And then here's a look at your next seven days. We're going to straight stay dry today and through Wednesday. We may see some isolated showers, but going into Thursday, we clear up. But once again, our high today is 79 degrees.